now at 11, though, we want to get you back to that breaking news we've been following all morning long here on ABC 24. Law enforcement now giving us details on a hostage situation that nearly lasted nearly 14 hours. That standoff at Dean's Tax Service started around 5 o'clock yesterday evening and ended just before 730 this morning. We had crews on scene all night long and this morning. Brittany Clemens reports on what happened there this morning. This is a sad situation all the way around. Police saying that a person held three people captive overnight. Those three people included two adults and one child. The suspect is believed to be the boyfriend of one of the hostages. Police also telling us that the child and one of the adults fled the scene a few hours after being held inside and the girlfriend of the suspect who family identified as Pamela Dean remained inside until about seven o'clock this morning when police saved her. There weren't really any demands other than a, uh, he said several times that no one was going to leave here alive tonight. And uh, he, he threatened officers multiple times, said, hey, just come through the door and I'm going to shoot you when you get here. The Tipton County Sheriff told us that they have made over 200 calls to the suspect to try and get everyone out safe. But as you heard, the suspect made threats to Pamela and law enforcement all night, so they had no choice but to ultimately shoot and kill the suspect. They also tell us that for the most part, everyone was is OK, except for one of their officers being shot in the arm. He was taken in to a local hospital and is recovering from surgery this morning. They will be sending out a press release later on this evening, giving out more details as to what happened uh, yesterday and overnight. Reporting, I'm Brittany Clemens.